just to reiterate then, um, what we're looking at here today as rubbish collected is one week's worth of uh, rubbish that's been put on the streets of West Rill and the surrounding areas. So again, clearly totally unacceptable. Uh, residents have got a number of methods to, to help this not to happen. Mattresses, uh, for example, can be collected by the council. There is a service for that. Um, uh, broken utility items, washing machines, fridges, all these sort of things can be collected by the council. If the residents get in touch uh, or via the website or by phone, uh, this, this can be arranged. Uh, it's not a problem for us. Fly tipping, I mean, look at this. This is a result of uh, one week, two collections in mill. It's disgusting crime, very dangerous for the community, the environment, and it's very disappointing really that uh, somebody would go to these sort of lengths when they can dispose of their rubbish legally by taking it to the tip or of bulky items. The Denbyshire County Council will come and collect it. So it's only five pound per item. But if somebody is caught doing this, it's a criminal offence. They will get fined £350, but also the criminal offence means that uh, it can affect job applications, housing applications. It's just, just not on, really. But the community as a whole, fantastic, but it's just the odd person that creates this sort of mess. But as you can see, this considerable pile is probably a result of quite a few people doing this sort of thing. Accumulating rubbish also in gardens is again not good for the environment, we can get rats and it's a bit of an eyesore all around really. So what we're asking for is that people take more responsibility. If they do see somebody that's fly tipping, if they can get a registration number, any evidence and Denbyshire will prosecute them.